it's really interesting when you, you talk about the title of the book, The Invisible Entrepreneur, because in reality, they're not invisible. They are there. They're leading. The entrepreneur's always got to be the leader. The, the book is about invisible. You're not there managing. You're not there interfering. You are there trusting. You're leading. It keeps coming back to lead, lead, lead. Set the vision, set the strategy, set the plan, set the measurement, and then let people get on with it. That, to me, is what the invisible entrepreneur is, is about. I mean, you could say the invisible entrepreneur or the great leader entrepreneur. It doesn't matter. Because if you're a great leader, then you're not there all the time, 24 hours a day, seven days a week with everyone. People know that you're exerting influence, that you're exerting direction, that you're, you're helping them, that you're really working with them. But they don't feel that you're looking over their shoulder. And that to me is what invisible means. It's you're there when you're needed, and when you're not needed, you're off doing something else. And maybe that's when you go and sit by the beach and watch the waves come in. For it to be an invisible entrepreneur, what do you need? Great people, great process, great vision, great leadership, great measurement, and a great accountant. Thank you.